Okay, so today we're going to make some leaders. This is very easy to do, very inexpensive. Don't need many much stuff. You need a little bit of wire, you need some sleeves. You want a barrel swivel, a snap, and some special crimping pliers. That's all you need. Now, <clears throat> for the wire, it'll tell you right on the package what sleeve to use. This says to use number three, so I bought a package of number three sleeves. Make sure you match them up. This is only 20 pound test. Uh, it's made by American Fishing Wire, which means it's made in USA, USA. But you want to make sure that you have strong enough wire. I don't need much. What I'm doing is I'm bass fishing in ponds where there's a lot of pickerel. And pickerel have teeth, and the line gets in their mouth. They start moving around trying to get that hook out, and it cuts the, cuts the string. You lose your favorite lure. You lose the fish. The fish swims away with a huge lure stuck in its mouth. Not good. So I make some little leaders, and I only need about 9, 10 inches at the most, and 20 pound test is fine. Now remember when you're making these, if you're going after big fish and you're putting 50 pound test or more on here, remember that your snaps and your barrels have test also. So, you know, if you've got a 100 test wire and a 20 test barrel, it's not going to work. So make sure everything matches up. Now all you got to do to make these, I just take, I'm going to measure this out roughly, it doesn't have to be perfect, about 10 inches, and just cut it with some wire cutters. This is stranded wire, this is nylon coated, and it's black. All you got to do with this, is slip it through, oops, put the sleeve on first, put the sleeve on, then put your barrel swivel on, and now you're going to turn this around and stick it back through that sleeve. And it gives you a little loop. Now you don't want to stick this tag end all the way through. And you can pull on the longer part and make that much smaller. You don't need a big loop. Just make a small loop there. And all you got to do is take your crimping pliers and put them on there. crimp it good and tight. Then turn, rotate your leader halfway and push it to the other end of that sleeve and crimp it again. So that way you have one crimp going one way and one crimp going the other way. And that makes it good and strong. So, same thing the other side, just put the sleeve on, put your snap on, bend it around, stick it through, pull on your longer end, and you are set to crimp. Rotate it halfway, push it to the other end, and crimp again. And there is a leader. Tooth proof against pickerel. And if you're going after walleye, pike, muskies, you're going to want something longer and heavier. But that's all there is to it. Um, you can get this as a kit, I believe, from Netcraft. Jan's Netcraft, and you get the pliers, 
the wire and some sleeves. You'll have to get the your barrels, your swivel barrels, and your snap separately. It's an inexpensive way to do it. Leaders aren't super expensive, so if you don't use many, you might just want to buy a package of them. But if you enjoy making things yourself and you want to save a few pennies, this is all you got to do. Simple. Thanks. See you later.